Welcome back to another video. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to get 40's signature underwater sound right here in FL Studio. Let's get into it. So if you know Noah 40 Shabib, you know his signature underwater sound. All the highs cut away. It sounds super gritty. A lot of people think that it's just using a low pass filter to cut all the highs. But 40 has said in some of his interviews that it's actually downsampling. And I've seen a lot of videos on how to do downsampling wrong. But today I'm gonna show you one of the right ways in FL Studio, super easy stock plugins. Let's get into it. So one of the things is this isn't gonna come from a synth. This is gonna come from some sort of audio file. It can even be like a bounced synth, but it has to be audio. So I just took this sample from Splice, it's LFH, two 120 FM basement piano out of Lo-Fi Bliss. We'll drop it into FL Studio and get to work. Now, if we listen to the sample, it just sounds like this. Not too bad, but we want that underwater sound. Go ahead and do that by clicking on the sample and then right clicking at the bottom on the waveform and you can go down to edit in audio editor. This pulls up the sample and then right click right here where it says sample rate. Don't change anything except for the sample rate here. You can go ahead and put 2000. If you want it a little bit more underwatery, you can put 1500, a little bit less, uh, 2500. Use this to taste something you can experiment with and make sure you hit resample. Everything else stays the same. And go ahead and use this icon, drag it onto your original sample. You'll see it change a little bit and we can go and play it. This is really just removing the highs, but it does it in a different way than a low pass filter. It gives it some different tonalities. It's a little grittier, and this is generally how 40s productions are sounding. Now, I don't love these chords, so I'll go ahead and show you how to turn this into a production if I just chop the, uh, the ends here, play it like this. Now I like that if I stretch it out, make it a little slower. Now that sounds nice, nice and slow. Now for 40 sound, he does other effects on it, but this is the starting point to get that underwater sound. I'll throw on a low cut filter and also some phaser and then I'll show you this full production that I threw together. If I just turn on a vocal channel, just that easy, it'll sound, sound something, something like, like this. Seen this bad little John, she was perfect. I let her push the for you right now if she worth it. Falling in the middle of the club, no jersey. I don't want no looker cause I've been drinking that dirty. All right, so there you go. That should give you an idea on how to downsample like 40 does. Get your productions sounding a little bit more like that. Something to experiment with. Thank you so much for watching. Hope this helps. If you have any questions, let me know. I will catch you on the next. Ne ne ne